Hi, today I wanted to talk through um, one of the tie carriers and depending on how you say it, may die, may tie, uh, may day, uh, my die, I do, just no matter how you say it, it is essentially a carrier with a tie waistband and tie shoulder straps. And these carriers are good because they're quite lightweight, they haven't got anything to them really. Um, there's lots of different designs of them, so some will have really wide shoulder straps, like this one has got very, very wide um, shoulder straps, probably almost the width of a wrap, um, so they are quite wide. Um, others have uh, slimmer shoulder straps with a slight bit of padding, um, but in general they're not very padded, so if you're finding that, you know, you want a a structured kind of structured carrier but buckle ones aren't fitting you then you can perhaps try one of these so i'm going to go with this and also it's very adjustable so that if you've got a bigger child um and then you want to carry a smaller child you can just adjust it so i am actually going to i've got this in my hands with it hanging down in front of me like an apron so i've got the waist strap flat on my stomach and the carrier's hanging down in front of it like an apron and I'm actually going to fold it because I know my baby, um, my one-year-old, which I'm going to pick up in a minute, is too short for this carrier. So I'm going to fold it over and then I'm going to fold it over again because she is quite petite and this carrier is big. Okay, so that's that and then I'm going to tie it in a double knot behind me. And you can tie this in any size you want, which is one of the beauties about it, because you can adjust it as small or as big as you need. So that's secure, and I'm comfortable with that. I might actually just move it down slightly, because I know that when she comes into the carrier, she's going to be quite high. Okay, now I'm going to get baby. Come on, baby. Up you go. There we go. And I've got baby and I'm going to put her on my front facing me and her head is just below my chin. So I'm going to make sure the carrier is going knee pit to knee pit, which it is. I don't have to. I could fold if I needed to here. I could fold the sides in um, at, at the bottom and at the top so that it fitted between her knees. I don't need to at the moment. I'm bringing the carrier up her back reaches to the nape of her neck. And then I'm going to take the shoulder straps over my shoulders. Now, I could, she'll probably want to have her arms out because she's quite big. And um, so I'm going to put the, the right strap over my right shoulder and I've tucked it under her arms. So the carrier's going under her armpits. And then I'm going to do the same with the left side, tucking it under her armpit, bringing it over my shoulder. So now they're just hanging down my back on the floor. They're quite long. Sometimes a lot of material puts people off, but these are very good adjustable carriers. So, and baby is now secure as long as I have got both of the straps. So I've got hold of both of the straps behind me and I'm now going to keep them as tight as possible um, keeping the tension on them I'm going to bring the right one um, behind me to the left and the left one behind me to the right so that they are crossed on my back you've got that nice cross position which is going to distribute your baby's weight then I'm going to with the strap that is coming from my right I'm going to go over the right knee of my baby the strap that's coming from my left is going to go over the left knee of my baby and then we're going to cross them over uh, under her bum so crossing them over under her bum and then we're tucking them under her knees underneath her knees there we go and then we're going to bring them back round and tie a double knot just above the one that we tied on the waist um, in this case you can just tie a single knot and then you can go round and you can check to see if there's any slack so if there's any slack right, there is a bit here on my um, right hand side so I'm going to just take the slack all the way back round if 
following it round under my baby's knees, through the cross, back round to the back, then I can tighten that particular strap before I tie the double knot, which makes it secure. And then safety checks. So, baby breathe, yes. I can fit two fingers under her chin, yes. She's secure, she's not gonna go anywhere. She's comfortable, I'm comfortable. Um, everything is good. And I mean, she's definitely close enough to kiss. She's almost in my face at the moment um, because of the height that I put the carrier to, to start with. But you will learn to adjust that as you get to grips with it. So this is the front carry. May ties can also do back carries and hip carries. And they are suitable from probably about four or five months. Um, they can do newborn, but you would have to fold them because most May ties are actually a bit big for newborns um, and not, not great for those sort of like first cuddles. But you could fold it, if that's your only option, you could fold it in several ways um, to make it smaller. Um, but they are very, you know, good as... As children get older, they can be used on your back. Um, when your toddler gets bigger, wants to be carried, they can be used on your hip. Um, and they're very lightweight. And once you've got the hang of them, they are very quick to tie. Um, if you'd like any more information about a May tie, my tie, or how, whatever you want to call it, um, please contact me. And I can show you um, in another video a back carry and a hip carry. Um, with one of these carriers i might choose a different one and uh, next time but um i have got several of these different versions of these to to rent if you'd like to um to borrow from the library um so please do get in touch if this is something that that takes your fancy and i mean equally they can be good because you don't have to use the waistband you can um, do the carry without the waistband and just relying on the straps under the knees so if you were pregnant and you didn't want sort of something around your tummy there's an option for that as well so please let me know get in touch if you fancy borrowing one of these carriers